Hey, what's going on everybody? It's Mark Shelf Space and I'm back. Got a few more packages arrived this week from, I think these all came from eBay. So stick around after the intro and we'll go ahead and open them up. All right, welcome back. So let's go ahead and open these up. All right, the first one here, I don't remember which where I, which shop I got these from. It was an eBay comic shop seller. So the first book is Sword Number Two. I think this is a Dotterman. I don't know Dotterman. Maybe I don't remember who the cover. But I realized that I I ordered the first one through DCBS. And then forgot that I ordered it, so I didn't order the second or third one because you have to pre order, you know, a couple months in advance. So when number one showed up in my box, I had to go back and order number two and three. I think I ordered number three from TFA because I think it is still, you know, it hasn't been released yet, so I can still get it through TFA. Next is crossover number one. This is the 1 in 10 incentive variant. So I really like this series a lot. I read the first three issues and I'm curious to see where Donny Cates takes it. Uh, but this one, I mean, I'm kind of waiting around to see if Cates does another signing because I'd like to get this, one of these crossover books signed by Cates uh, just because it's, you know, it's an original work and I think the story is pretty cool. If you haven't read it yet, I suggest you check it out. And then I've got two more copies of Planet of the Symbiotes, number one. So this is the first appearance of Plague. Cortland Cassidy becomes Plague. I went, for, you know, for my purposes, what I consider pretty heavy on this book. And ordered quite a few copies from different sellers. You know, to just kind of sp spread the support around. Alright, next, this book says it's from HJ Book Outlet. I like that these all appear to be packed in some sort of Gemini mailer. I've got a few packages recently where the seller just sent them in like a bubble envelope, packed in between some cardboard. And the books look like, you know, I mean, they, they arrived fine, but just kind of a risk to take of the seller to send stuff that way because the post office service is not always careful with stuff. Almost got this here. All right, this is. King and Black, Planet of the Symbiotes, number one. But this is the one in 25. Incentive cover. So you see you got Plague. This is a Plague right here on the cover. I missed out on a couple of these early auctions on eBay. Um, people were selling just because I lost track of time. And I missed the auction. But I, the first couple auctions that sold, I think, were in the low 20s. And then now they're like in the $30 range. I think because of the people are, you know, they see the same spec with the first appearance of Plague. Plague being a rel an ancient relative of uh, Cletus Cassidy. And this book looks okay. I do feel a spine tick on here, but it doesn't look color breaking. I saw a few of the copies of those on eBay and they had like, they didn't look very good. That's kind of a bummer because it's, you know, it's a 1 in 25, so shops that order those, maybe they only order 25 copies, they got one of those, and then it comes in bad shape, you know, I mean, I think people will still buy it, but I just don't, if it's not going to hit, you know, a 9.6 or a 9.8 on a modern book, in my opinion, then typically I won't bid on it, just because I don't know if it's worth the gamble.
the last box here is actually just some more Planet of the Symbiotes. So this is just three more of the A cover. I think I may even have more of these coming. Maybe I bought, I think I bought, I think I bought more than I remember. But hopefully didn't waste my money on these. If not, I mean, I like the story, it was, you know, so far. I'm excited to see where, I think it's a three-part miniseries, so I'm excited to see where two and three go. And what, what Plague does within the series. Hopefully, they don't banish him off, you know. But even if they do, I mean, I feel like he'll come back. I just, if they do banish him off, I think it's going to hurt the resale on that, you know, the potential resale for, until they bring him back again. Uh, but that's it for now. So if you like what you saw, like the video, shoot me some comments. And I look forward to putting out some new content shortly. Thanks.